My name is Carrie. I'm Adam Kokesh's girlfriend, and I just have a quick message for the prosecution and anyone else who may be watching. I understand that you're well-intentioned and you think that you're somehow serving the public good by prosecuting Adam for these very misguided DC gun control regulations, which he performed an act of civil disobedience against. But I want to give you a little bit more context of the situation so you understand why Adam is really in jail. And it has nothing to do with the shotgun. It has everything to do with his most powerful weapon, which is his mind. Because every time Adam has a confrontation with Parks Police, and it's been a lot, Adam uses his logic and reason and rationality and peaceful communication to explain to them why walking around carrying guns and inflicting force against people to oppress their rights is wrong and they usually walk away looking like buffoons. So that's why they hate Adam and that's why he's sitting in jail right now. So if you want to be a part of this violent system and enforce laws against peaceful political activists, you go right ahead. You can throw him in solitary confinement. Give him the maximum sentence. You know what he's going to do in solitary? He's going to catch up on Rothbard, which you should really read. And he'll write his own book. You want to put him in general population? He's just going to make friends with all of the oppressed and disenfranchised people there who have been screwed by the system that you help perpetuate. And they're going to spread it to the outside to all of their friends. And all of a sudden, the message of liberty is spreading. And that's because it's not dependent on Adam. You can jail a revolutionary, but you can't jail a revolution. Huey Newton said that, and he was a Black Panther. And they were very oppressed by the government because they got sick of being persecuted because they were Black, so they stood up against it. And what do you know? That sparked some new gun control regulations. So you should really let Adam go because whether he's on the inside or the outside, it's irrelevant. Because because the message of liberty is independent of Adam and every single day people are waking up to the true violent nature of government and how exploitive and persecutive and prejudiced it is and how much it violates people's rights. So you should let him go free and you should especially let him go free because I really miss him and we were supposed to watch Breaking Bad this summer and I watched it without him and I'm going to watch it again with him but I really miss cuddling him and watching Mad Men and documentaries and his really sweet dog Baloo who would have totally been shot by the police when they broke in the door if he hadn't been created immediately. He really misses Adam too so you should free him now. Thanks!